guys, welcome to my English channel. Today's tutorial is very exciting for me because I'm recreating the signature look for the Nightlife collection, which is my collection with Sigma. And you guys have probably seen the review on the collection, so today is the tutorial of that look. But I will be creating a lot more looks, but today's look, the signature look, is very feminine, powerful, and it's a look that you can rock on your night out. So I really hope you like it, and let's get started. Okay, so the first step for the eyes is eye primer and today I'm gonna use my favorite one primer potion by Urban Decay and the shade is Eden So I'm gonna put that all over my eyelid and on my bottom eye. So next I'm gonna start with my nightlife palette and the first shadow I'm gonna take is Bijou which is a highlighting pearl shadow with a E55 eye shading brush also from my collection I'm gonna apply it under my brow now I'm gonna take topaz which is a warm brown shadow with a pencil brush and I'm gonna apply it on top of my crease going from the outer corner to the inner corner of the eye and I'm gonna take my favorite blending brush, E25 by Sigma. And I'm gonna blend it. Starting from the crease, going upwards towards the brow. Next, I'm gonna take a matte deep brown shadow. This is After Hours from the Nightlife palette. And I'm going to apply it on my outer corner. Now I'm gonna come back with my blending brush and blend that. Now I'm gonna take a black matte shadow. This is Leather Pants. And with a very tiny brush, I'm going to apply this on the crease, just on the outer corner, to start making this eye a bit more dramatic. And of course, we're going to blend more. It's all about blending, right? Now I'm gonna take the Urbanette shadow, which is a deep purple and matte finish, and I'm gonna apply it right in the center of the lid, which blends with the brown and the black. So now I'm gonna apply this gorgeous eyeshadow, Disco Ball, which is this silver. It's one of the shadows that I like the most in the palette because it's so beautiful. Look at this, it's very pigmented, and I'm gonna apply it with my finger and it just pops. So you can apply it with your finger. I feel like you get a better pigmentation out of it uh, and finish, but I'm gonna touch it up with a little brush, just like on the edges. So it's perfect. So now I'm gonna come back with that highlighting shadow on a very tiny brush, and I'm gonna apply it on the inner corner on top of the silver. Okay, so now to the bottom eye, I'm gonna apply black eyeliner. And this is Eclipse. It's a dual liner from the Nightlife collection as well. And I'm gonna take one of my favorite brushes, which is the Flat Definer. I love this brush, especially for my everyday, because I just, uh, what I'm gonna do now, I do it for like an everyday makeup and it makes such a difference, it makes your eye more open. So I'm gonna take the After Hours Brown Shadow with this brush and I'm gonna apply it really close to my lash root. Just to darken it more close to your lash root. And now to the fun part giving a pop of color to the eye. And I'm gonna take this gorgeous purple shadow, which is VIP. I'm gonna take it with a pencil brush and I'm gonna apply it all over my under eye. And look at how gorgeous this shadow is. Now that we're done with the shadows, I'm going to apply mascara. And today I'm gonna to use my High Impact Extreme Volume Mascara by Clinique. 
and I'm gonna apply a bit on my under eye. Now I'm gonna apply false lashes because yes, false lashes make such a difference, especially on this night light look that you're gonna wear at night. So today I'm gonna use the 117 by Ardell. I'm gonna apply it and I'll be right back. So I'm back with my lashes on and now I'm gonna apply liquid liner and this is by Lara Geller. So I'm not gonna go crazy with my liner. I'm just gonna apply it really close to my lash root because I want the shadows to stand out more. All right. So that's it for the eyes and I'm gonna finish the skin with you guys and I'm already gonna tell you what I have used so far. So to prepare the skin, I used my Photo Finish Primer by Smashbox just to hide the pores and make your face a bit more your skin a bit more velvety and foundation i chose my nars sheer glow which i love and the shade is stromboli and for powder i used my dior nude air which is a very light powder and my color is 030 and the rest i'm gonna do with you guys so concealer i'm going to apply a highlighting concealer this is the prep and prime highlighting concealer by MAC and my color is Radiant Rose which is a bit lighter than my skin tone but that's on purpose because I want that highlight so I'm gonna apply it here creating a triangle and on top of it a bit of my Pro Long Wear concealer by MAC And I like to blend it with my beauty blender. All right, so after I put concealer, I like to come back and touch up the eye, especially like the bottom eye in case, you know, you get rid of some eyeshadow. So I'm gonna touch it up here with my pencil brush. Ta-da! <laughs> All right, so now I'm gonna contour my face and the good news is my nightlife collection has a bronzer that I created especially to contour So you can use it as a blush as well, but I'm gonna contour with it today. So it's the limelight bronzer By Sigma and it looks like that and I'm gonna take the brush that comes in the collection as well the large angled contour brush, which is F40. So I'm gonna apply it here under my cheekbones. So I also applied it on my chin already. I did apply it on the nose and on this side I applied everything, of course. Now I'm gonna apply blush and I'm gonna use the Hot Spot, which is also from the Nightlife collection. And it's a beautiful coral color that has no shimmer so I'm gonna apply it with the tapered highlighter brush just on the apples look how gorgeous it is and now I'm just gonna take a dual fiber brush and blend it And I'm gonna apply liquid highlighter that also comes in my collection. And this is Afterglow. It looks like that. And with the brush, I'm gonna apply a little here above my cheekbone and under the outer corner of the eye, right there. And a bit on my cupid's bow. Now with my finger, I'm going to dab it. And it gives it such a natural highlight. So now I'm gonna finish the look with lipstick. And I'm so excited about these two colors because they're so gorgeous and I've been wearing it so much like since I tested the collection for the first time. And I'm just really excited that I'm actually using it now and you guys can see it because I used it a few times and you guys actually asked me like on social media is what I was wearing and I couldn't tell you <laughs> because it hadn't launched yet. But yeah, this is the color. So the lip liner is in fine feather. So it's a beautiful mauve shade that's very versatile. And it looks so good on, on all skin tones. So 
So I line my lips to make it look fuller, like a Kylie Jenner effect, almost. And on top of the lip liner, I'm gonna apply my lipstick, Dance Till Dawn by Sigma. Also for my collection, of course. And it's a pinkish nude. That's so feminine. It looks amazing with the lip liner. And that's it. So that's my nightlife look. I really hope you guys liked it and I hope that you recreate it with me. And stay tuned because I'm gonna be creating a lot more looks with my nightlife collection. And if you wanna check out my collection, I'm gonna leave the link directly to Sigma here below. And I have also done a review on the whole collection. So if you wanna check it out and see all the details, click here. I'm gonna leave the video right here for you guys. So yeah, before we go, I wanna teach you a Portuguese word. Today I'm gonna teach you how to say nightlife <laughs> so in Portuguese you say vida noturna repeat with me vida noturna I really hope you liked the video please don't forget to rate comment I want to know what you thought about the look and subscribe if you haven't I'll see you next time stay beautiful